Get a poison. Got him lane. The fairy fire. Moon looking for PPD. He's in trouble. He's below half HP. Fear getting kited as well. But a couple more right clicks. PPD's got three sticking napalm there. It's going to be another fairy fire. Oh, PPD's he's going to get PPD, alive. but who dies first? It is. Peter, Pan, damn, Fear also low, has the stick, has the rage, could chase this, and with an open wounds ready, can he get in range? It's just terrible, Mott. Oh, man, and Sumail is starting to really take advantage of the CS over No-Tail right now. With 17 only for the Medusa, you have a the line forward, here Sumail. we go. Sonic Wave, not there with the mana, he has it now, he's gonna use it, and that's the kill. But without a blink on Batrider, the lockdown's not reliable, and Crit gets caught out here and completely Stomped out by Fear and Sumail. Another nice pick. It was scouted. I he, guess OG not realizing there was a lifestealer inside, but you see that Queen of Pain marching around on your side of the river. You've got to expect there's a big game coming. Universe Duel maybe coming in. Press the attack first. They have the spirits, and there it is. Can they get this kill? They're going to jump in. Sonic Wave hits on it too nicely. Not dead yet. No dual victory, but they've gotten one kill, and they're about to get two, but the last one comes out. No Tail does end up going down, but it's Moon alone right now. Crit is back up and alive, ready to go. And Miracle's top pushing that tower. It's three dead for OG. And Sumail looking for more. Jump in Crit. Shadow Strike. Should Crit. be dead here, I think. Crit is just so underleveled at this point, and he doesn't even have a single point in Untouchable, so Sumail could just easily right-click him down, finds another kill. Draw lineups will eventually come online. It's just a question of, do you have enough to deal with it? We'll we'll see as Boon right moves now. in, finds PPD. He's going to get caught. No Queen of Pain ult. If like that's that, all they lose in the tower, I don't know if it's that bad. That's, that's my one concern. Io and Crystal Maiden are so freaking squishy. Even, oh, Fly, he's in deep. A base armor, and here comes the duel, but they have that stone gaze, and Universe gets caught with it. The right click's coming through. Universe about to fall. Overwhelming odds might be able to get him out alive. The high ground uphill miss will not be there. Sumail blinks away. They've taken down three. Smoking from behind. You're, you're addicted to the old complexity, but here comes the lasso. Oh, or not. Nice. Uh, Flame break, jump in. There's the duel. Stone gaze in front of Universe to make sure he doesn't have that right click, and he just stands in his tracks. It's still Zai going down first, and next it's going to be the Legion. They haven't even used Lasso yet, Mod. This is number three, unless Sumail can blink. He whips the ultimate and then dies. Insult to injury, as OG will now march towards the Life Stealer and potentially towards the Roche Pit. It's another three heroes. They lose the Enchantress. Crit doesn't really give a damn at this point. They just want to get these kills. And then because of that, they secure Roche. Down well. Meanwhile, OG pushing in bottom lane, going for the Sansa PPD. Doesn't connect on Universe, who is going for the jump. There's that duel, but the Stone Gaze comes out. He needs to be in front of Universe, and now he is, and still brings him down. Fear in trouble with Rage up, infests out. Oh, that's what Drow needs. More damage. Fear, he can't take it. They're skating forward. Big Daddy going to work, and Fear is going back to the well, while Miracle continues the siege. From the side, Sumail will come. He's looking for the cleanup. Can the young gun get it done? He gets the kill, but he gets flame break backwards. They're going to continue pursuit. A fly stun, a miracle silence, and Sumail trying to do too much for the team will die, but nobody wants to go. Somehow Sumail's always a little too far out of Moon's range to be able to grab him. And they blink it and gust him, but Fear jumps right out. Miracle might be trouble. There's going to be the lasso. Stone Gaze comes out as well. Universe going to get caught by it, and it looks like he will be brought down first. Oh, they do go for the relocate save. Unfortunately, that means Queen of Pain not in the fight initially as oh, Miracle man. barely survives. 30 HP! Kill this man, EG! They just can't do it. He blinks to the north. Can they clean up with the Drow on the run? They bring down the Enchantress. Drow survives Surviving, turning back for the Deuce of Fear is very strong at this point, but his rage ends. He needs to back away. No Tail is doing some work, but it's not nearly enough. They Miracle's get still kill. alive! Oh he kills Ayo! He's killing everybody! Almost gets the Crystal Maiden as well! Mamma mia! Io doesn't have relocate. He's just going to buy back a TP in and try to get to the tether in time. Held it. They're expecting OG to make this exact move. Um, the gust again, and Sumail is in so much trouble. Good duel on the Miracle, but and the relocate save. Still, though, that's Universe dying instantly, and PPD is next. Bob comes back, but OG just looking too tanky. Miracle will drop, but he's got a second life. Can they get the job done? Nota running out of mana, but he's going to Manta and continue to duke it out. Fear as the rage ends. The pain begins. Silenced, clubbed, and dead. Four have fallen. That's 
Dead Silence can be devastating, especially in cases like this where key heroes do not have it. But top lane, there's the duel. In universe again, he gets a full one off this time. The Sonic Wave, no Tails mana is gone. They will bring him down. Moon in trouble, already used the lasso in fear. Finally starting to go to work, but again, the damage. Miracle has a DD and is going to work, but the life steal is pretty good. They get the press of the attack, it's not enough. Two for two exchange, and they might get universe. He blinks out and dodges the last raw auto attack from Miracle. Hey, buddy. But we'll find him, though. That's just awkward. Still, Miracle gets the kill. Oh. So despite Crit having maybe a rough early game, he has a Moon Shard now along with this Hurricane Puck. No Aghanim Scepter, but plenty of range. And it's and not like you can be focusing Enchantress, right? You have to kill the Drow or the Medusa to start the fight. Speaking of which... He's going to go for a duel, and Miracle might actually be in trouble, but Universe taking a lot of damage as well. Sonic Wave finishes it off and gets on Fly as well. From the backside, Crit coming in, and No Tail as well. Can they get anybody down? PBD, Freezing Field, won't do enough Zai now. Last it up, can't get that relocate out. In fact, it was already used. Universe... He's able to get back home. Sumel going to work. Crit about to go down. Looks like the last right click will get the job done, and No Tail might be next. That's three down. Looking for No Tail as well. They even bought back on PPD for this. They're going to kill Big Daddy, too. Four down. Can they make it five? Moon for Steph TP. He saves the gem, but OG. Smoke is coming. Two of a Bat Rider. And they are moving towards the pit, oh, and this Roche is not so going close. quickly enough. Mon OG are going to be able to contest. The freezing field, just to make sure they actually can't blink in. Roche goes down, Sumil gets the Aegis, though, and now Moon in trouble. Gem down on the deck, he's dead for 67. He's got the buyback. I don't think you go any further if you're OG relocated. Sumail taking a lot of damage. He's got the Aegis, but now he's down. Miracle getting caught. Fear gets the rage off before the Gust comes in, but here comes No Tail, the split shot going through LD. Buybacks, buybacks everywhere. Now Moon rejoins the fray. OG want to get something out of this, but Zai relocates back. Back to safety. The last auto attack following him. He will die. Universe trying to heal himself. They focus on fear. Dragging him back. Slowing him down. The eye of Scotty. Can they get the life stealer low? Gets off the cheese. Then the duel. EG somehow, some way, turning this fight around. No tail won't die. He won't go down. Finally, it happens. Moon looking for more. Sumail is so low. There's going to be a jump in. They're not done yet, Mod. They're still going in. It's four dead, and the only survivor is Fly. Fear looking to chase after him. No open wounds for three. Flies very fast in his own right. They're going to get it. Crystal Nova off, and Fear is diving towards the Tier 3 tower. Four staff not there for five. There's That's no rage. A triple dieback if Fly goes down. They can't quite get him. Four heroes on the sideline. He gets the gem, though. Three of them for a minute. That top lane pushing in favor of the Dyer. They might get a Rex here, but is it going to be enough? Because EG have a lot of time. Medusa just getting the gold now. Able to buy back, so they're only down a drown and a bat, but those are two important heroes. And OG feeling, I, I would not say confident, but uh, feeling like maybe they're back, they're able to apply pressure again. They lost all of their gold advantage off of that fight, but they gained an even greater Rax advantage, so. It's going to come down to this engagement, but they have the high ground. There's the scan. It's a little far away. The lasso, they break the Lincoln Spear. Sumail's caught. Relocate save. Not there in time. Sumail pulled away from Zai. Sumail about to go down. He doesn't have buyback, but Miracle getting caught. Fear in trouble. No tail going to work, and there's the duel. Wins it, but the Queen of Pain dying back. Universe getting focused. The relocate save for now, but Miracle sees it as an opening. Blinks in. Kills off Universe, and... With that, Zai forced to back away, so they find themselves EG 5v2 for a minute. Those are the only two heroes that have a buyback, is of course Zai as well as Fear. They're healing up right now. They're about to lose another set of racks into tier three tower. Not to mention Top Lane is still pushing in with a big creep wave yet again coming through. This is a tough hold. Sumail doesn't have buyback for another four minutes, so they, they won't be able to get the most important hero for EG back in, or at least one of the most important heroes, and there it is. Rax now gone, Fear blinks in, and he's about to get caught. Kited around, Impetus going to work with Crit and the Hurricane Pike and the Moon Shard. Fear is down. dead, and that's it. It's GG. EG. They get, they turn around an 18,000 gold lead into nothing, and then they immediately lose the game. That is a heart-wrenching way to drop game one. They made this a lot closer than it looked like it should have been. Just some great execution, good pickoffs. I. I think the one thing that really hurt OG was there was like three or four fights in a row where the stone gaze was very late from no tail. You're every day 1v1, but PPD's found one. Disruption into arrow, bottom side of the map, direct hit on fly. And they've, yeah, that's just a, the setup, the classic setup. They're going to be a charge down bottom. PPD comes in. And just Universe is coming. He's got silence. the shield. Need to be able to chase these heroes down. It's kind of tough. Crit walks up and he might just die. He'll try to TP out now. Some good damage. There's going to be a jump in and boom, the Dream Crawl gets Sumail a double kill with a waiting rift on top. 
Moon coming in, Firefly as well. Sumail has that Dream Quill. He's got to just jaunt away, it looks like. Gets the waiting ripped off. Sumail doesn't get to the high ground of PPD. Gonna go down, they get the Dream Quill off. There's the Miscoil, here comes Universe. He's got the Aphotic Shield, Moon getting low. That Aphotic Shield breaks. Might be enough, good stick charge. Not enough to bring him down, and Moon will survive. Universe ends up falling, Sumail getting solo. Finally able to jump back up to the high ground, charge closer to that tower. Coming. Crit's going in deep. Sumail doesn't have an orb. There's no mana, actually just got the stick. When you think you might not be able to get a tower, you have the battle chance to help out, or even a kill. They're gonna fight mid. They just smoked there, right in front of that tower. The smoke broke immediately for Miracle and No-Tail, but they're still wrapping around with the rest of this squad, at least flying Critter ready to charge in at any moment's notice. But here comes Universe just running in. Arrow's gonna split the uprights. Crit will come through. Good disruption for PPD. The Gust came out as well, and Crit still silenced Drew Cole on two. Moon does get the last swap. Fear in trouble. Now the Star Storm, and Zai's getting focused down as well, but Sumail is going in. Sumail's going in. Great play there by Universe, able to shield off the lasso, keeps his drow safe, and now the arrow, a deep connection on Moon. They'll bring the bat down too. EG continue to mount their siege. Who do you lasso? If you go on drow, A, she's got Aegis, B, there's disruption. Ideally, you get the Shadow Demon here, but then there's the Iphotic Shield to remove it with the double defensive supports and bat as the most reliable initiator. How do you go in if you're OG? Not sure the charge has to be there, but PPD with the disruption, like you mentioned, the, the defensive supports coming out from EG is it's easy, it's easy to stop these charges. And Crit's gonna TP to the tier two tower mid. Look for maybe a charge but from there's behind. There's a ward there. There's two wards there. They see him coming. They know that he's there. Fear could gust and PPD is ready for the disruption, and they will see it. But the last one comes out in time. There's gonna be the silence from Crit. Fear now in trouble. Still has that Aegis though, and he's gonna get caught with the frostbite. Down once, might go down twice. Zai gets out in time. Great disruptions from PPD to save the day. Can EG salvage this fight and turn it around? Gust is there into Miracle, but now Moon's caught out. There's the Curse of Avernus and the Frost Arrow slows. Miracle is now in trouble. He's gusted up. He's silenced. Finally able to reuse that Refraction and turn back around. And it's going to be the Range Racks finally going down as Ichi get it done. Moon, Moon is just sitting there. I think he got arrowed as well. He had to buy back. Now in trouble. Shadow Poison. Two stacks will not go down. Should stay alive and will be up and ready to go as No Tail gets caught and he'll fall. He's got buyback and he might have to use it. I. This is all crumbling for OG, but Crit finds a really good charge. There's still a borrowed time. The shields come out. PPD with the disruption. The old man lays him with the arrows. Crit in a lot of trouble. EG just racking up the kills. They're all so low. Can no tail kill anyone? Can he kill four? Or does he get nothing? Charge interrupted. Spirit Breaker down. It's four. Five, six dead, I think, with the double buyback. Was it for the Radiant side? But they do finally start to clean up. That's an ultra kill for no tail at the end of the fight. EG stay a little too long. Smoke of Deceit coming through with a couple of these oh, heroes from EG. They, There's the Moonlight Shadow on top of it. I think they smoked under that Dire Ward mod. They see him coming. They're gonna actually break the smoke. They're gonna come through. There's the Dream Coil under four. The silence, the guts is there. Breezing Field still available for Fly. He's gonna use it behind the tree line. Might be enough great disruption for PPD and Miracle's on the run. Sumail still moving in. He manages to hide and get away. The Moonlight Shadow is winning this fight for EG along with Sumail's AoE combo. Crit low, crit dead, four down. No tail, the lone survivor. Only one buyback with Miracle and that's it. Even if you buy back, you're not holding this lane. They will have to sack this melee Rex. The good news is they still have two tier twos left, but but it, it just feels like more is sure to come. I mean, there's a 10,000 net with lead. This is before it's even updated after that team fight for EG. In the mid lane, another smoke, OG. Moving out. Lanes are pretty pushed in, though. And there's good vision here from EG. So with the, the map dark, they may back away. Zai leaps in, Miracle moves forward. He gets the vision, but Sumail gets off the Yules. They're gonna go for the Dream Quill. Oh, now they get caught out by everybody in Universe. Dream Quill will come through, Sumail's still in trouble. Lasso's up on him. And we'll be able to not bring him down just yet. He gets the phase shift away. Miracle's still there looking to right-click him. Crit getting laid into with the arrows by Fear, and he brings him down. Moon actually about to go down to the Shadow Poison. Only one stack, though. Miracle gets arrowed up. Point Blake range from Zai and gets Universe the kill. Universe is chasing. He wants a piece of fly onto the Crystal Maiden. Still has the borrow time and the stick charges, and they isolate the Crystal Maiden. Bring her down. Zai leaps for more. Three dead. Looking for no tail. A back and forth bloodbath. And it's time to buy back, says Crit. But already that tier three. It's almost fall. And EG all five alive. Do they keep on pushing? I think so. They could go back for Roche. It is up now already, but Moon's so low, getting caught out with the silence. Still not enough. The arrow coming through, but it's going to fade before it hits him. The tier three tower gone. Glyph not available. EG about to finish up another set of racks. Miracle has buyback, and he's going to have to use it. And will. TP's coming in. 
This disruption coming in as crit was going through. Silence is up there as well as the Demonic Purge. Crit gonna go down. But here comes the damage coming through with the Desolator. And Moon getting chewed through and he'll die as well. Even the Centaur Conqueror gets involved. The old man showing off his micro skills. Next on the list is Miracle EG looking to make this a 1-1 tie and even it up in Group A. And they will. The boys in blue hang on against the Green Dream here in Seattle. All five hit the deck. 46 kills in 23 minutes, a uh, two kill per minute, absolute bloodbath, but EG take it. Smiles from Sumail there, as they keep their ambitions of an upper bracket berth alive.